This is Chahira Kanain. I am a 26-year-old Gemini. She can help you check in to your flight or help you book a hotel room in several dozen different languages. She is very personal, but she is not a person. Chahira is a robot programmed to keep weary travellers at airports and hotels happy. Chahira is being showcased at ITB, the world's largest tourism convention in Berlin. Her lifelike facial movements may be scary to some, but according to some industry experts, Chahira and robots like her might just transform the travel industry. I think what we're seeing them being used today is with uh, sort of lower skilled uh, roles, you know, things like uh, room service or, you know, luggage porting. So we're seeing that already today, but I think it's really about the next development of robots, which is going to be play a really significant part of uh, travel going into the future. This is Mario. Mario is also showing off his people skills at the convention. He can hand out hotel keys, wave hello, and read PowerPoint presentations during business meetings. But it's his ability to interact in new ways with travellers that has the industry excited. He can dance, he can sing, uh, he can put on the show, and he can also interact during a sports game with kids, for instance. While these robots can automate much of the front office work at hotels and airports, some say they can never replace humans completely. I think it's uh, fun entertainment, uh, but um, I don't think that robots in the future can uh, change uh, or replace completely human being factor because um, humans are humans. And robots are robots. How they will fit into the future of travel remains to be seen.